Hi friends, once again welcome back. This video is regarding Income Tax India website which is newly launched yesterday. So as you can see on the screen the URL has changed now it is incometax.gov.in. So from now onwards if you wanted to view your previous ITR returns or if you wanted to file an ITR income tax returns everything has to be done through this new portal so in this video we will uh, quickly see things like whether you need to register for new user portal and also how to reset your password and what is the dashboard items quickly you can see on the look and feel of the page if you are looking for income tax filing through this new portal you can click the link above where we have uploaded another video uh, where you can see how to file income tax ITR1 form for uh, salaried persons. So in this video we will cover the main highlights and other things uh, user credentials of the new website. What you can do is open you can do from mobile also open a google search page and then uh, in the uh, URL you can give income tax dot gov dot in I will div, uh, give this in my video description you can copy paste it okay so once you log in first time it will take a little bit time to load you can see here e-filing 2.0 this is the name of the portal e-filing 2.0 and as you can see there is an icon here a uh, kind of a head icon you can click on this there will be a genie pop-up you can cancel it once you click there you get two options okay register and as well as login so register is for persons who is doing it for the first time that means new pan users if you have already an account with the old portal you can directly use login you don't need to register here okay use the same username password of your old portal it will work let us see if you already have an username password with old portal and then you try to register what happens okay it will not take much time you click on register and first it will ask you obviously the uh, taxpayer pan so what happens if you have already registered in the previous portal you enter your pass uh, pan number and click on validate it will clearly show you you have already registered you can see here this pan has already been registered that means you don't need to register it again in this portal you can use the same username password so let us come back click on the login button once you click on the login button as you can see here it will ask your username password obviously most of the time username is the pan number itself if you have any other username like aadhar card or any other username you can give it here but most of the case it's pan number as user id okay so enter your pan number and click on the continue button once you do so uh, it will ask you for the password and there is an uh, message here you have to tick the message i will show you that suppose you enter the password enter the same password of your old portal okay do not change it the same password is going to work here you can change the password later now after entering the password you have to tick this option otherwise it will not work please confirm your secure access message you can see here after that only the continue button will be active now you click on the continue button uh, you can see here welcome to e-filing portal and there is a timeout so by default 40 minutes it will be running session timeout it is don't worry about that your work will be saved if you are doing anything so this is the dashboard as you can see here once you log in this is the dashboard and you get an option to skip it or you can update your profile okay so if you are uh, changing your bank details or your uh, home details anything you can update your profile so this is the exact uh, home page or dashboard as you can see here your uh, profile will be so and so percentage complete you can update your contact details bank account you can see here there is an update button if anything is changed you update it otherwise the old data from the old portal will be pushed pulled here total outstanding demand will be shown here and in case it is null it is shown as nil so as you can see here if you scroll down you can uh, file your return uh, at the end for this year file option also there uh, filing returns is shown in another video you can see that okay so there is another options so if you scroll down if you have any pending action with the uh, thing like last year or previous year you have some action is pending it will highlight in red there is a pending action one it is shown and recent filed returns also you can get here 
and any issue with the portal or issue with anything regarding income tax you can click under grievance and file it so this is the dashboard as you can see so if you click on the icon on top as you can see you were using same thing for the login you can log out here and suppose you wanted to change the password this is the option to change the password because first time when you log in it is always better to change the password because you are using the same old uh, portal password let us uh, uh, click and uh, change the password and it will not take much time you have to give your old password and new password two times and click on the submit it's so clear and very fast process and very importantly you have to remember these things use 8 to 14 characters for your password one number should be there alphabet upper and small case both should be there and also a special character has to be there these things should be meeting for the new password okay so once you can see here enter all the things it says password matched and click on submit button your password is changed successfully okay this is the transaction id of the same for every process you get a transaction id here and you get an sms also saying that your password has been changed so this way this is the look and feel of the website and if you wanted to file itr through this one i have uploaded another video kindly watch that thank you so much if you like the video kindly share also please subscribe and give a like to this video